Um, it's Ollie SCA here, and we're going to be reviewing the Alcatel Surreal. It's a nice, cheap budget phone that works amazing. Um, as you can see, uh, the it's got amazing like like specs specs. Let's say that. Um, so the rear camera is like sixteen megapixels plus five megapixels. Real time behavior, shot refocus, AI scene detection, which is amazing. It works perfectly. It's able to like change like f work out if it's a dog or a cat, like a si like a night view, a city view, a person, a girl or a boy. It's just beautiful. I've never seen a phone this cheap work this well. And trust me, I've had a lot of phones, a lot of them quite cheap. It has Android 9 Oreo, and you know I like Oreo, because I used them twice in the video just a second ago. Um, it's got single tone flash, so it doesn't really, it doesn't have the iPhone's double flash that makes photos look more realistic. But it still, it offers a colour detect, colour, uh, colour correction, which almost fix, it almost makes up for that. Except sometimes the colour correction can make the photo look dull. But I don't mind that because it makes it look more realistic. As you can see, the camera quality is focusing quite a lot whenever I move around. And it's it's amazing. I've like it may look bad here, but that's because well it's me. Um it's got an, a nice amount of storage. It's got face key, face unlock, and it's pretty impressive. It's it's just an amazing phone. Like when you open it, it gives you like quite a lot of stuff. These stuff like warranties. It's just a nice phone. It's just nice. But have I answered the question? Is expensive better? To answer that, not entirely. I've seen multiple phones like come off as amazing in marketing, but they they've made it expensive. It's it's not the best though. I've seen like the Huawei uh, Mate X, that foldable phone. It looks horrible. People are saying that it looks good, but honestly, it just looks horrible. You can see the screen feedback. I know it's new technology. But Samsung has done it better. They should have waited until it's a pattern, well, an easier technology to master. Samsung mastered it perfectly. But Huawei Mate X, horrible. Not good enough. And the, what, ah, oh, I can't remember what it's called. Um, but there's an illegal, there's a phone made by a drug lord's brother. It's also a foldable phone, which claims to be indestructible. It's obviously not. It's extremely expensive, but they say it's a good price for what it does. And I've seen the trailer. Um, it runs that really bad Android that you got you got on ten pound tablets. It's just is annoying. And well, yes, cheap can be better than expensive, but is it better than the best expensive? No, just no. Because there's the new Lenovo phone coming out soon that has a 108 megapixel camera. And that has got to be one of the most detailed cameras I've ever seen in my life. It's beautiful. But this phone, it outperforms some phones of high price. But it does not mean it's necessarily better than high price phones. Thank you for your time. I'm Oli SCA. Or, well, I might be changing my name soon because why not? Right, this has been Ollie SC8. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you want to. Don't subscribe if you don't want to. Ollie SC8, bye.